giraffe love baby I got that shirt for the shirt for Christmas and um, I none of my family knows about nerd fighters or anything like that my hand hurts I've been invaded she has been following me around for the past like two days and I don't know why she's kind of mine and Jadis is kind of Aiden's we kind of got him because she this one attached to me so with Rachel I knew the book on your head before like the first two seconds into the your video so I was like oh, that was a perfect book to choose I was kind of proud of you. You asked about how many songs I have in my library. I also use Spotify, so this is not all of them. 1,151, which is translated into four days. Uh, Marissa, I loved your hair this week. It was like shiny and like cute, or did you cut it? Um, Danielle, Mona is adorable. Carly's the same way with, uh, she doesn't ever want to get in, she's afraid of baths, but she's so obsessed with being there when we take showers or baths or whatever. Julie, I am kind of jealous of you too, and I have never met a nerd fighter in the wild. So, nerd fighter week. I took off the cover of The Fault in Our Stars because, um, it kept, like, coming off. I didn't want to get ruined, so I put it somewhere safe. But for everyone who can see how incredibly lucky I am. Oh, I got a hankerfish thing now, isn't it? Licking the signature. I'm not gonna lick my book. I love books. But I have a fiance, so I'm good. Let's see. My favorite probably nerd fighter thing, the draft love. I also got in into the Vlogbrothers. Um, he didn't know they existed and now he's obsessed and one of his um, birthday gifts this year was Hank's Ellen Hardcastle and we listened to that nonstop for quite a while until I said enough. I'm very, very obsessed with John Green, but I, when I read his, I have this problem lately of when I read things and authors, especially John Green, I just keep thinking of, oh my god, I'm never going to be this awesome or whatever. So I have made like a good new goal for myself as an author or an author to be whatever writer I am going to trust myself because I was rereading my very first Nano novel for the very first time because I couldn't sleep last night and I was finally going through it and reading it and other than like jumbled mistakes because you're going too fast I kind of liked what I wrote like I wasn't completely horrified with what I, I had done for my very first Nano novel I finished and I know it took you six hours I put off reading mine, like I read, I read a little bit and read a little bit, but when it got towards the end, five chapters from the end, I stopped reading um, because I wanted Aiden to be home when I was reading it because I didn't want to do it alone. So I finished it just last night. But as the reading whore I am, I've already moved on. So this is my next one. I also made myself a bookmark because I couldn't figure out what to do with my little penguin charm. I got my stocking, so... Oh, and a small little announcement. I have, as you know guys know, I've um, been doing a, what's called the IPRG. They're part of the TAPS family. And it became official as of yesterday, and now I'm officially the IPRG YouTube person. <laughs> I'm supposed to edit the videos and put them on the channel and direct people to our page. So I'm going to put a link to the channel down below, the IPRG channel, and I'll have um, paranormal stuff. So I'll also put a link to our forums, which any of you guys can sign up for and just chat on. I am on there all the damn time. A word of the day. Wander. I want to know what your biggest fear is when it comes to being a writer or um, trying to become an author. Danielle! So I rolled you and Julie rolled you so I don't think you're allowed to be rolled again. I will see everyone next week and Rachel I will see you tomorrow.